I am Anil Kumar and in this video I am going to explain you two different techniques to find polynomials coefficient under given conditions. Question here is find the value of p if 2x plus 1 is a factor of 8x cubed plus 10x square minus px minus 5. Now if 2x plus 1 is a factor of this polynomial then what should be the value of p of, in this case, minus half? Why minus half? If I put x as minus half, I'll get this as 0, right? So that means I have a 0 at minus half. This value should be 0, correct? Since 2x plus 1 is a factor of the given polynomial, that is from the factor theorem, right? So let's substitute x as minus half and then find the value of p. So this is method number one. So when I write x as minus half, I get 8 times minus half q plus 10 times minus half square minus p times minus half minus 5, right? That gives me minus half cube is minus 1 over 8. So let me write this as minus 1 over 8 plus this would be 10 times 1 over 4, right, square. Minus minus becomes positive, so this is p over 2. And here we have minus 5. Now this could be simplified and written as minus 1. And 10 divided by 4, I could simplify this as 5 over 2. Here we have plus p over 2 and then we have minus 5. All this is equal to 0. Now to simplify it, what we can do is we can multiply by 2 on both the sides. So we have 0 equals to all this, correct? When I multiply by 2, what do I get? I get 0 equals to minus 2 plus 5 plus p minus 10. And from here we can solve minus 2 plus 5 is plus 3 plus 3 minus 10 is minus 7 so I get p minus 7 or the value of p is 7 so that's one way of doing it I've taken all these steps to show you how in steps we can do it but you can always use your calculator and in one sentence you get your answer now let's apply the second method and this one will be by using division. Since we say that the 2x plus 1 is a factor of this polynomial, the remainder should be 0, correct? So we can divide. You can perform long division or synthetic division. Let me show you using synthetic division. So I'll do it right here. So we'll do synthetic division. We are going to divide the polynomial 8x cubed plus 10x square minus px minus 5 by 2x plus 1. So we have to write here minus half and this coefficients are 8 plus 10 minus p and minus 5. So first step bring down 8 multiply by minus half you get minus 4 add them up you get 6 6 times minus half is minus 3 add them up you get minus p minus 3 now remember you have to get remainder of 0 right so here remainder should be 0 how can you get 0 if I add 5 to minus 5 I get 0 that means what that means that minus half times minus p minus 3 should be equal to 5, correct? Do you see that? That means this, right? So from here, we can solve the value of p, correct? So that gives, let us solve it now. So we get from here, minus p minus 3 is equal to, let's multiply by minus 2 is minus 10. And from here, we can say, P is equal to 10 minus 3. 
which is 7. So either way we get the same answer which is p equals to 7. So you can adopt any method you like. Either you can do factor theorem right or synthetic or long division and get the same answer. I hope the strategy is very clear and with this you also understand how important synthetic division is and how simple it makes the whole problem. I am Anil Kumar. You can subscribe to my videos and learn more. Thank you and all the best.